JD Cap 26 here. I just do the tips, fairs, and hobbies. Hey guys, hope you guys and girls are doing okay today. And uh, yeah, we're going to do another model. I'm going to build one. And the model today is going to be War of the Worlds, the alien. And uh, look at the detail in this box. I mean, Pegasus really does a nice job of uh, the color and the artwork and everything. It's called the Alien Creature. And um, this is a newer release of this alien. There's an older release uh, that looks more like the original movie. So let's get a knife here and let's open up this box and see what's in it. I was just watching a morning video I always watch. I watch a Morning Invest. I don't know if you watch it or not. Um, with Clayton Morris. Good guy. Here's the news and what's going on in the world. So, uh, I'm going to open this. I don't know why I got this wax paper here, but let's open this up. Oh, okay. Okay. So here's the bag of stuff. Wow, it's got a big, it's got a big uh, plate, bottom plate here, and instructions. Here's the instructions. And uh, I save all my instructions. Looks pretty easy to put together. I don't know. I don't know if it's snap fit together or or um, whatever. But I take some of these pieces out of here. And what I do with the box is I get rid of the bottom box, but I save the top and I then I cut the box top off and I slip it into a. Uh, the uh, <clears throat> a file I have, I save all the box tops. I don't save the whole box itself. That looks like a leg. Look at that. And uh, some smaller pieces here. And some smaller pieces on a spew. And I don't know what part that is. So here's a... Uh, Here's the uh, face of them. Well, it looks like the chin. And it's this part. Okay, the bag's empty. Make sure your bag's empty. Don't throw away any parts. And, uh, gee, let's see how this goes. I put my glasses on, guys. So it's got a this little bottom part on the mouth and it looks like there's a little other piece that goes in the middle of that and I should be using the, the nippers here to cut parts off and there's two pieces like that those two pieces are for his his arms okay those that look, look like fingers this is a cup of some kind I'm out of focus. I'm very sorry about that. I just put that over there. It's a teddy bear. And these two pieces go to the arms. <clears throat> Let's see. Yes, we have to follow instructions. No doubt. And... Looks like... This goes like this, like that. Okay, so you put the bottom piece in like that. And then it's got two of these. And they both look the same, and I don't know why. I guess one goes in like that. You're going to have to disassemble this, and uh, this may be an extra piece. Yes, additional neck is supplied. There's an additional neck, so you can use this neck, or you can use this neck, which is straight on. I don't know really which. I think the crooked one would be better. So let's put that one aside, and let's get some glue out. 
I use uh, either on these on these on these type of models. I'll use green stuff or a Gorilla Glue, and uh, just put a drop in there. I was thinking when I was going to do this model that I could light it up in some way, but um, it's all pretty solid, and there's no way of doing that. So, and now here's his body, and this goes in there like that. Pretty gruesome. This is for the newer movie, I guess. I guess they did a newer movie of uh, War of the Worlds. So put them in there like that. And we've got, <clears throat> we've got some legs here. Those go. Huh. That goes like that. These are the legs. Uh oh. I'm getting stuck here, guys. Looks like there's a peak bottom part missing. Hey guys, uh, forget the Gorilla Glue. You're gonna have to use green stuff, buddy. And uh, it's really not, if you really wanna get this model together, you gotta mix the green stuff. So I mixed up a small batch here. And it's gonna pinch it off a little piece. Put it right there. And we're gonna stick it inside there and put his head on. Okay. That's the only way you're gonna get this together. And I'm gonna pinch off another piece, smaller ball, use little balls, and uh, put it inside there. And I think this piece goes on like this, like that. Sorry guys. Okay, and that, that'll dry overnight and that'll be pretty solid. And I'm gonna put the, the other parts on here, hopefully. It seems like they have two legs, so that's not. Hmm. Still getting stuck on this, guys. I don't know why. That doesn't seem right. Oh, okay, like that. Okay, so let's get another. The geometrics of it, you know, the way it's positioned, because it's going to be on like all threes. So we'll take that piece out and just stick some putty in there. And then. Stick that in there like that. And then take another piece of putty. Put that over there. You got like about, I would say 15, 20 minutes with the putty to, uh, before it really starts curing.
Got to go like this. Like that. And twist it up like this. My wrist is really not doing that great, guys. Not doing that great. I'm trying to get this. Okay, turn it like this. Let's see. So it's like that. You know, one part goes into the other part. Trying to figure this out. I guess it's it's like that. There we go. Match the curve right there. So Hmm. Okay. Then we got these little arms here. We have to cut off. And those little arms go one on each side. Take some little pieces of putty and I'm stick a little putty on that side. And then it's got these little pieces. Let's see, where were they? Hmm, here they are. These little pieces right here. Really got to cut them with the snippers. Take a little piece of putty. These are the little fingers. These are the little thumbs that go on. Like that. Little thumbs go on there like that, see? Do the other one. It's a crazy sculpt, really, the way they sculpted this. Really crazy the way they put it together. Looks like I'm gonna have to do some some compounding. Hmm. So we did get it together here, and we put it all together with green stuff, okay? Green, blue. And uh, this is the base for it. Look at that base. <clears throat> this wording should be easy to paint. And uh, that'll be another video of the painting I have uh, to do. Um, but it actually goes like this on the base. Then you put these other parts in here. I think this teddy bear goes, there's two points over here to put the teddy bear. And he goes like that. But he's got to dry for now. And uh, we'll paint him later. And this is the video for today. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. He kind of looks from, like from Alien, doesn't he? I think they took from that movie. And we'll see you next time. Please rate and subscribe. Give me a thumbs up. It really helps me a lot. Talk to you later.